Oh, I needed that. It's 32 degrees Celsius, and with the humidity, it's about 38 degrees. In days like this out in the woods, it's almost impossible to stay ahead of your hydration needs. Certainly, you can't carry enough water. At least, I'm not going to carry all the water I need. So the answer, some type of a filter, something that will purify water that you can find along the way. So for the last few weeks, maybe even a month now, this is the bottle I've been taking out on every occasion because it's just so simple to use and so good in terms of quality and effectiveness. This is one of the Epic water bottles. If you're interested, keep watching. All right, just before we get started, I want to thank Epic Water Filters for sending out this water bottle. It's a Nalgene, one liter Nalgene, along with this water bottle, a 750 milliliter Nalgene, both with filters in them. And uh, yeah, so I've been using this for about a month on every occasion, uh, not just out here in the woods, but around the house as well. And I'll explain why in a few moments time. And they have worked especially well. But what I thought I would do very quickly is just go over a few of the specifications the, for this filter, and then I'll talk about my experiences using it. All right, for the purposes of this video, I'm just gonna focus in on the larger of the two water bottles that uh, Epic sent out to me. I'll just take the smaller one and put it aside. Only difference being is the size. Of course, they both come with exactly the same thing. And what they do come with is two filters. So I have their everywhere filter installed in the bottle. I'll take it out and show it to you in a minute. But they also come with this. This one hasn't even come out of the package yet. This is called the Every Tap Filter and it's blue. And this will go into the filter capsule which is down inside. Again, I'll show you that in a moment. And this filter is intended for use with water that you know is safe you just want to go the extra step to remove any unwanted flavors or chemicals, anything from chlorine, fluorine, heavy metals, whatever else that may be in it, any taste from iron, you name it. This filter will do that for you because basically it's an activated carbon filter. But when you combine an activated carbon filter with another technology, that's what you get in this Core X technology filter. Let me just show you that inside. So the filter itself is actually housed inside of that white capsule. And here's something I want you to see right away. Can you see what's written on the side of it? Made in the USA. That's one of the key factors. This, this entire unit is made in the United States. No offshore production for any of this at all. So they have absolutely control over the quality and the specifications for it. So that's what you get when you buy one of these bottles is both of those filters. These filters will remove an incredible amount of contaminants. In fact, I'm not even going to try to list them all in this video. I will put it in the video description. I want to take a quick look to see what all it removes and to what percentage or what um, log degree of removal it'll do. And by the way, all the research, if you are interested in going a little deeper to make sure that you have the confidence that it will remove it, the Epic Water Filters will provide the research on their website for the filter so you can see the testing that has been done on it. But it'll say it, the uh, everyday tap filters, the ones that the little blue ones, that alone will remove up to 70 contaminants because of its carbon filter. But the Core X technology will remove over 200 different contaminants. Again, more than I'm going to try to list right here. And of course, they're swappable, so you can take one out. You don't have to use your, your Core X, your everywhere filter around the city. You can just swap it out and put the other one in, and you're good to go. And then when you come out to the woods, swap this one back in and replaceable because you can buy replacement filters from Epic as well. The other nice thing is there is a 100% lifetime, no hassle guarantee. If you're not happy with this unit for any reason, Epic will replace, not replace it, refund you the money. So that's a nice confidence builder as well. Just so much going on in this builder. Now, when you go to the website and you uh, go down through the list of available, pro available products, the first thing you're going to see is that they actually have three classifications of products. They have a filter that will go in your refrigerator, which is a pour-through, so it fills in a, a larger jug that you can put in the refrigerator, keep cold. That is not intended for water out in the woods. That's like the everyday or the every tap filter. They also have under sink filters, the under uh, tap filters, uh, the ones that will uh, tap uh, filter out a lot more, so that's another classification. Then they have the water bottle filters, which I'm demonstrating you for you here today. So they have those three. Then you go down through the list of the available water bottles. It's even incredible. This one is called the Woodsman, I think. Just a nice artistic piece on the outside of it, just to snazzy it up. But the caps themselves will fit 
any Nalgene compatible bottle. So if you have another water bottle that is has will accept a Nalgene cap on it, then you can use this with those bottles as well. And they have the double walled stainless steel ones if that's what your interest is. Not something that I want. I just prefer this uh, Triton bottle. But they have those as well. They also have replacement caps and filters. And I'm saying that for a reason because one of the things I was interested in is would this work with another water bottle specifically? I'll tell you which one it is in a moment. And yes, it does. And that is the Swig Rig. And that's a review I made of another product here about a year ago, the Swig Rig. And it is a 1.5 liter Nalgene bottle, much taller than this. It has the hose that runs out and you, so you can put it in the side pocket of your backpack or right in your backpack. And you have the mouthpiece on the end of a hose so you can draw on it like you would a hydration bladder, yet it is a water bottle. Well, can you use this filter in that bottle? Absolutely, you can. I tried it and fit it. You just have to cut the plastic tubing to the right size to make sure the filter sits at the bottom of the bottle. But you can do that, and now you've got really the best of both worlds. A liter and a half of water that you can scoop up from any stream and drink on the go with the tube, the bite valve on it, and you're good to go. Or just carry this. This is much nicer, or actually the smaller one. For just a quick scouting hike, this is the one I carry, 750 mils. It's plenty big for most of the water needs I have. Not today, though. Today, I need a lot more water. <sighs> That's amazing. That is amazing. Now, I will tell you that because of the filter, and it has a plastic tube running through up to the bite valve on top, the bite valve folds over like that and gets it out of the way. You do have to draw on it. You can't tip it back and just pour water into your mouth. It won't work like that. There is a bit of a draw that you have to put on this in order to make it work. By the way, they do have another cap with a plastic uh, cover on it, one that snaps over the top of it if you're looking to make sure your bite valve doesn't get uh, dirty from any anything else. But uh, I just wanted to point that out. So there is a bit of a draw. Now, there's nothing wrong with that. It works just fine. I, I like it the way it is. What I was hoping for is that they would consider making one of these filters that would work in a gravity-fed system like a Sawyer. And when I asked the company, they replied, it's not in their plans right now. Who knows where the f future may go? And that's because the way this filter is designed, it takes a fair amount of force to drive the water through all of the materials. So it's denser, more tightly packed, and there's two different elements in there, the polypropylene, uh, nanofiber tubes, I think is what it is, plus the carbon filter. It takes a lot to draw the water through that, so it wouldn't work in a gravity-fed system. So, uh, yeah, this is strictly for drinking directly out of. But it does that extremely well. I have all kinds of confidence in doing this. In fact, I just scooped this out of a stream that's half dry and very turbulent looking, not very good at all, but I have comfort uh, that it's doing a good job of filtering that water out. Okay. That's everything I have to say about these water bottles. I cannot say enough about them. This is certainly one of the best carryable water filter, bottle style water filters that I have ever seen. Made in the USA, so there's a tight quality control over the components. And yeah, what I'll be doing is putting the specifications for this bottle with all of the list of the contaminants and the degree of removal in the video description, plus the links to where you can take a look at them if you're interested. But if you have any comments or question, put those in the comments section below. But until next time, get out and explore, take that path, let's travel, and remember, Stay hydrated.